Oh, 11 days of celebrating the beloved strawberry. Yes, it's time for this year's strawberry festival along with delicious strawberries. There are new dishes and entertainment to enjoy as well. And joining me with a preview are Paul Davis and Cindy Griffin from Maverick's Chocolate Barn. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us back and congratulations oh, on your Thank you. Son. Thank you. He's in there moving around wanting some bacon. I, I know. A strawberry festival exactly. is a pregnant mama's uh, dream come true. Absolutely. Uh, you guys ready? This is we another, are, I mean, we are ready. busy 11 we're days coming up. We're actually excited to get started and it's just getting, just, it's building. Yeah. How is strawberry season, by the way, this year? Oh, they're good. They're yeah. Good. They're good and ripe and fresh. And we're they're ready. very ripe. Look Dip at them, them in yeah. chocolate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which, and I'm so glad we we're doing this, the, the chocolate covered strawberries and, and what the Maverick Chocolate Barn is all about. Mm -hmm. Strawberry shortcakes, they get a lot of love. Yes. But there is so much other good food there, too, with strawberries. So and tell us a little bit about uh, what you guys are doing. Okay, we have Maverick's Chocolate Barn and Chocolate Strawberry Express, but we do chocolate dip bacon. <laughs> we have. You, I, let me try this oh, while yes. you're. While you're explaining Chocolate everything, okay. bacon. We have a shishka berry here that is five berries on a stick. That you can take white chocolate. A shishka Our berry. That's chocolate. awesome. We have the Rice Krispies for those that come to the booth that mm -hmm. do not like strawberries. And then we also have, you can take it home. It's a barn, so you can take it home. Oh, you can actually crate. take that home. Half okay. dozen or a dozen. Wow. And then we have the single dip berries that are down there. And explain to me, Maverick is your son, correct? Maverick is my son. Mm -hmm. Did he help name it, the, the barn, or what? how did this all come to be? Well, this I'm a far really good. By the I'm way. a farmer's daughter, mm -hmm. so I wanted something to carry on my roots and named it after our son Maverick. And yeah. So he's how long have you been in the Plant City area? I'm born, raised, and still live on the yeah. same road, but not the same house. So I'm a Plant City and true, true. You're ready for all the traffic coming. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about the entertainment oh and everything that's coming up because it have, is a lot. It is a lot. We have we have over 30 bands actually on the main stage. Mm -hmm. Several of them, there'll be like one, one show will have three people, three mm -hmm. different groups, like Coasters, Drifters, Platters. We have Pam Tillis, Susie Boggess, Terry Clark. That's one show. Okay. That's a lot of entertainment yes, rolled up is. into one. Uh, and we open with, um, we have Willie Nelson, mm -hmm. uh, Alabama, uh, Brothers Osborne, Old Dominion. Then we have the Letterman. We have Pat Boone. And we have Keith. I'm telling you, Keith Sweat is just going to, he is really Okay, gonna, yeah. yeah. Cooling the gang. Okay. They come out with their horns blaring and having a, everybody stands up and dances. It's a fun time. So we have so much well, entertainment. And you guys really get big acts to come each and every year, which I think says a lot about the Strawberry oh, Festival really and kind of the name that you've built for yourself kind of nationwide. Do you Absolutely. see that, that these artists are going, oh yeah, no, we've heard about this. We want to be there. Oh, well, King and you know for King and Country, yeah, they are wanted by everybody. Mm -hmm. They're just taking the nation by storm, and we were so lucky to. They've get been them. on our show a couple of times. They, I absolutely love them. They're, they're one the of my favorite deal. bands. They, they are. Really are. Old Dominion and Brothers Osborne won the biggest awards in yeah. the CMAs right after we signed yeah. them. Thank goodness. <laughs> so uh, so we really we're excited. Yeah. But what's more important is on the tents all throughout the grounds. Mm -hmm. There's entertainment all day. We haven't raised our prices for probably 22 years and so for eight dollars you can get in the gate four dollars for children and be entertained all day wow less than the price of a movie yeah now to be clear though the big concerts those are going to cost you a little extra a little right bit. Well, we so charge how does enough that work? To, yeah we charge just enough to pay for them yeah you know, so because our thing is to get people in, mm -hmm. they're going to eat a chocolate covered strawberry or yeah. they're going to eat a shortcake or they're going to ride a ride. Yeah. So we just do it to bring people in and let them enjoy the show. Yeah. Nothing better than to come out Saturday afternoon, go ride rides and then come sit down to a show and then eat some strawberries yeah. on the way out. What are some of the other food options? I remember one year there was like a strawberry burger I tried out oh, there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And have, we have a Krispy Kreme strawberry hamburger. Now, yeah, I mean, that sounds about right. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's for pregnant women. You, know, you, you get all those cravings at once. Yeah. If you throw a little ice cream on there, but uh, of course, bacon. Yeah. Bacon goes with everything. Uh, that was absolutely oh, yeah, delicious. Yeah. So, where can people find where the barn is set up? The chocolate barn. Maverick's chocolate barn is located right in front of the Kellogg's tent, um, by close okay. to Gateboard Kittyland. Mm -hmm. Any tips on parking and kind of how to best? 
partake in the Strawberry Festival because there is a lot going on. Well, we have, uh, if you have to park out in our faraway mm -hmm. parking lots, we have brought in trams. Okay. And so it's kind of like a ride when you're on okay. the trams coming in. My and six and five-year-old love that too. Exactly. And then we have people talking, telling you what's special today, greeted by our mayor and okay. our chairman of the board, Sandy Sykesma. Okay. So we're excited. We're excited, well, and we're going to come back with the court. Yes. The queen and her court. Yes, ma'am. So we look forward to that. Thank you for yes, coming come in today. Visit we, us. Yes, yes, absolutely. Yes. This is a family tradition of mine. I grew up going as a kid as well. There's the details. We'll make sure and put it on our website as well. But guys, we'll let you go because we All know right. you've got a lot to be yes. prepared for.